it's another struggle stopping video Hey, hey, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for joining me today. I'm your favorite frugal introvert, Jerry. I get paid monthly, but I budget weekly, and I'm learning how to both manage my money and how to make more of it. So happy Savings Challenge Sunday, y'all. I hope y'all are doing well today. Drop down in the comments below and let me know if you did anything fun this weekend. My partner and I went to California Dreaming yesterday, and it was so good. That was my first time ever going there. He's been there before, but I had never been there before. But it was just really, really good. I really enjoyed it. We enjoyed ourselves. Spent a lot of money, but it was worth it. So yes, yes, y'all, this is a struggle stuffing video. So if you guys are new, welcome. Thank you for being here. A struggle stuffing is when I stuff anything less than $100 in my sinking funds or my savings challenges. So today I'm stuffing $17 in my savings challenges. It's my partner's birthday month. His birthday is on September 30th. And I just really did not prepare at all for the amount of money that I spent this month. So I'm definitely gonna be prepared for his birthday month next year. So let's go ahead and hop into the cash stuffing. But before I do, please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, comment, share, and hit that notification bell so that you never miss another upload. And check the description box for this week's hashtag BCL as well. So if you guys don't know what that is, it was created by Budgeting April here in the budgeting community. A link to her channel will be below in the description box, but it's a way for us to discover four new budgeting besties in the budgeting community every single week. All right, so here is the money. Let's go ahead and count it up. 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. All right, so here is my savings challenge binder. Everything that I use in my videos will be listed below in the description box as well. So we're gonna start off with Christmas, which is gonna get a dollar, a real dollar. And Christmas now has 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82. 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. So 219 dollars. And if you guys are new and you don't know, I use a combination of prop money and real money. Christmas is one of the sinking funds or savings challenges that gets real money. Everything else gets prop money because I don't want to have all this money in my apartment. Next is my 52 week savings challenge, which is only going to get a dollar. I am working on the number 15, or excuse me, 16 right here. So I did write an IOU up here. So I put 16, IOU 15. So I'm gonna add my dollar. And with my 52 week savings challenge, I do not count this until the end of the month when I do my um, monthly savings challenge update videos. Next is gonna be date night. This is also gonna get a dollar. And I owe this one $4. That way I'll be able to color in the second half of this table. So date night has 20, 40, 60, 75, 77, 78 dollars. And y'all, I may have to end up unstuffing this and just starting over and using this for next month. I really don't know yet, but we're gonna see how it goes at the end of this week. Next is One Bougie Introvert. All of these challenges are in my Etsy shop, by the way. Link to that is in the description box as well. But One Bougie Introvert, I'm using this to buy clothes and I'm only gonna do a dollar today. But each clothing rack is worth $6. So I wrote an IOU $5 on the back of this. So One Bougie Introvert has 10, 15, 17, 18, 19 dollars. This is really not a priority for me but I, I was hoping that I was gonna be able to finish it this month, but I just have too much going on for this month, so I'm not gonna be able to finish it, nor will I be able to finish my $63 savings challenge, but I am gonna put a dollar in it. And it now has 10, 15, 17, 19, 21, 22, 23, 24 dollars. So that's not bad. I can at least color in the number one here. All right, there we go. So the Beat Inflation Savings Challenge is only funded by rollover money, which I do not have. So we're gonna skip that. Lastly is Glamopoly. So last week I landed on save eight. I did also pass go. So normally when you pass go, you save $40. I don't have that money to save right now. So instead of doing 40, I'm saving four, 
plus the eight that I landed on, which is gonna be 12. So I've got my 12 here. And Glam Mobley now has 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 77, 79, $80. And if you don't know what I do with this money, I usually unstuff it at the end of every single month and then I redistribute it amongst different sinking funds and savings challenges that I feel like really need it. All right, so we are done with the stuffing. So I've got two more things left to do. The first thing I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do my Invest $100 challenge created by Mommy Trader. If you wanna pick this up, this is on mt1finance.com. This is her website. Unfortunately, because I'm only investing $5, I can only color in one flower pot today, but that's okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and color in this one flower pot. And then on this side of the screen, I'm gonna pop up that clip of me investing the money. Okay, lastly, we have Glamopoly. So like I explained earlier, I did land on $8. So I'm gonna go ahead and roll my dice and see where I land this time. That's five, one, two, three, four, five. So save $14. I think I should be able to do that. So I'm gonna go ahead and write save $14 right here. So I really appreciate you guys watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you never miss another upload. I hope you guys have a fabulous day. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Stay safe, be blessed. And until next time, peace.